Hello, my name is Nzila from Zambia. Uh, I'm here in Egypt, uh, Cairo, where we're learning about uh, ICT for education and development. One thing that I have learned from this workshop is that you can use all forms of ICT to bring about development. There are organizations or institutions that are contributing towards solar energy in areas where there's uh, no grid electricity. There are NGOs or organizations that are providing the hardware of the computers, desktops. Uh, there's Intel providing the software. There's uh, Plan Finland providing the technical skill. Plan USA, all these uh, VSO providing uh, capacity building life skills for the young people, uh, as well as building skills for uh, young women out there in the community. But then there's one um, initiative which I have uh, liked so much. It's uh, where um, uh, Plan Finland is working with um, the University of Uvascula uh, and Nilo Maki. They've developed a, an initiative of using the phone, mobile phone. Uh, the, the, the game is called Grapple phone initiative. The grapple phone user is built on a lo local language and it's also uh, improved uh, through the development of a curriculum using the local language and taught to children. Now these phones um, can also be found within the communities where children are found and parents can also learn how to read and how to pronounce words and improve on their vocabulary, they can improve on their literacy levels. So if organizations came around to improve on this initiative, fund it, I think the problem of high illiteracy levels among women in less developed countries can be um, reduced as many families now are acquiring the phone device so which will not only be used for communication but also as a learning tool.